into the arms of Kemba Walker. Randall left alone here. 18 footer rattles out, and Portis clears. Got to stop Giannis in transition. He pulls up for three and buries it. Five nothing start for Milwaukee. This is what we always say. If he makes that three consistently, forget about it. Turn the lights out. Right. You got no shot to defend him. It's hard enough as it is right now with him shooting under 30% from three. Robinson cleans it up from inside and gets the stuff. Here's Allen working off the Portis screen. Keeps the dribble. Shot clock down to five. Good feet underneath to Giannis for the left-handed dunk. Holiday made that happen. Holiday to the corner. Grayson Allen, who's back after a one-game suspension, missed the three. Rebound by Nerlens Noel, who's back in the lineup after missing Wednesday's loss in Miami. Kemba Walker able to hang and finish after ankle surgery. Barrett beats the shot clock but can't get it to fall. Here's Holiday pulling up in transition and hitting a triple from behind the arc. So he's already got more points than he had in each of the last two games. Seven each of the last two. Eight tonight. Portis, though, answers on the other end. 0 for 2 from the floor. No points. Beats it up top. And Burks unable to get that one from Triple Land. And Connaughton down the court. He's a tremendous athlete, as we've seen with that reverse layup in the left hand. Barrett. Too strong in the three, and an easy rebound for Giannis, his second board. He averages 11 per game, seventh in the league. Here he is in transition, like a freight train, but then the finesse at the end. Quickly, no good on the three. Here's Giannis in transition, and what a pass. He makes it look easy when he's bringing it up the floor, right in the shooting pocket for Holiday. If you don't wrap him up like that, if you're Alec Burks, he's probably going to get to the rim. A turnover stolen by Burks. Transition opportunity. Grimes sets his feet and delivers. Swishes home a three. And New York back with an eight. There's a maturity, too, about that guy. Giannis. Boy, they fly to him as soon as he catches it on the low block. Corner three. Allen rattles home. Here's Holiday in transition. Giannis goes to the wing. Holiday lets it fly. And Drew Holiday, five for five. Four for four. Anything surprise you when you saw the starter's name yesterday? Well, nice pass by Quickly and Toppin, who seem to have such good rapport between them. And, and, you know, those guys are in the MVP conversation. Devin Booker is right in the center of that conversation right now. Wow, Obi Toppin, half of his body was above the rim, which is going to shake until tomorrow morning. <laughs> Milwaukee with a 13-point lead. Here's Middleton. And Chris Middleton knocks down the mid-range jumper. He's got nine points. Yeah, I like his thoughts about it. He said, I can't get wrapped up in it. Can't get caught up in my feelings about not shooting it well. But this group for the Knicks has done a good job. By the Knicks to cut it to six with three minutes to go in the first half. Giannis in the paint goes up and slams it with the left. Robinson contested. Keep his own pace and his decision-making on point. How about 14 assists? The Knicks allowed the Heat to have 30 assists on Wednesday. Barrett. I mean, he got out of the gate so slowly. Just keep working. Having his best month as Middleton gets the roll. And a foul, a three-point chance. Here's Walker, who has six points. Randall just two. He's only taken three shots. Timers at five. Fall away jumper off the back rim and in for Julius Randall to get the Knicks within a point. Six seconds to go in the half. Holiday, Middleton, back to Holiday with two. DiVincenzo extra pass. Connaughton at the buzzer. A three. That was perfect offensive execution by Milwaukee. Here's Randall. Goes at Giannis, who has three fouls. Fournier penetrates off balance. It goes. He's a guy that can get hot and eventually cleared by Randall. Barrett, they didn't get back on defense, and Barrett makes him pay. Just a little bit of indecision. It'll tend to holiday underneath. But back to your point on Barrett. He's had a great month, 23 points per game. Here's Adetta Kumbo right down. Main Street for the slam. My goodness, how on earth do you stop that? Oh, my gosh. Not for lack of trying, though. He works on that. That was the other thing. He was out here shooting free throws, and he went right to the perimeter to work on his three-point shots. Here's Kemba down the lane. Flips it up and in. Walker with eight points. 
22 starting lineups. That's almost half the season. Yet they're 10 games above 500 as Randall gets the layup there for New York. He's having a terrific year. He'll turn 38 in four months. Fournier with a steal and a fast break opportunity. Barrett with the throwdown, and the Knicks are back within three. I thought that was the first four shot by Julius all night. Right? He was three for six before that one. Oh. And, yeah, and then. Here's Fournier driving off the backboard and in with his back turn. High degree of difficulty on that shot, and Fournier having a great night. Second team foul. Robinson sets the screen. Fournier pulls the trigger, drills his third three-pointer. He's got 17 points. Knicks back within two. Zone. Fournier aggressively attacks. DiVincenzo gets in the middle of the lane and floats it up and in over the outstretched arm of Robinson, who almost got a piece of that. Barrett. Nice move. He just couldn't finish. Batted out by Giannis to Fournier. Fournier to Randall puts it in. That's a big time finish because it gets back up off the court. And here comes Giannis. Three from George Hill is on the money. He was tied up with Giannis physically before he went over and blocked that shot. Barrett with a nice pass. Noel with the finish. So the Knicks are hanging around. Their starters have been good tonight. Their bench has been good. Giannis pulls up and drills it. So Adetta Kumbo with 26 points. Timers at five. Quickly draws Giannis on the switch. Now you got Noel with a mismatch on Hill. Gives it up to a cutting Alec Burks for the layup. They give up a three to start the fourth quarter. Alec Burks with a 12th made three for the Knicks. Get a layup though on the other end. Giannis had it momentarily, but... Could not corral it. It's still Milwaukee ball. Holiday on the attack. Out to DiVincenzo. Drives. Feeds Giannis for the two-handed slap. He's a feel for the young man. He goes down en route to a championship, and he misses all of that action. A starter. And he had started every game, too, during the race. You saw Giannis grimace, but got up and it looks to be okay. Holiday missed the three. Giannis with the offensive rebound. Takes the mid-range jumper. And 30 points for Giannis. Giannis walks into a three. That's good! Second three-pointer. 33rd point. How he shot him in the first half. Grayson Allen missed the three. Giannis battling. Gets the offensive rebound. And then what a pass! Out to Allen, who pays it off on a three. And they get something out of their backcourt. They got a lot in the first quarter, but Walker's been quiet. So is Fournier. Barrett now with 20 points. Connaughton penetrates, leaves it for Allen in the lane, and a couple of bounces, and it drops for Grayson Allen. Now sets a screen for Holiday. Feeds Middleton to the corner, and Middleton drills a three, his first of the game, and the Bucks have their largest lead of the game. Being first to the floor, doing every little thing, and it might take some time as, as this guy just continues to shoot it well, Evan Fournier. And in Atlanta, you had a relatively young team. The Knicks have a relatively young team and inexperienced when it comes to championships. I and mean, if that's not a synopsis of how things have gone for them. Giannis left alone, fakes, gets a little bit closer, and buries it. 38 points for Giannis. It was one for eight to start the game. Three-pointer goes for Mamu Kelosvili. Milwaukee still within striking distance of the top spot.